Now, there are plenty of foods out there that claim to have superpowers. They can do everything from improve your memory to burn fat. Unfortunately, very few of these claims stand up to serious scrutiny. However, this week we're in Cardiff, where we are going to test three foods that really may have unexpected health benefits. Over to Dr. Chris Van Tulliken. There seems to be no end to the spectacular health claims made for fruit and vegetables. But these three, garlic, beetroot and watermelon, are interesting because it's been claimed they do something very specific. They're all supposed to lower blood pressure. If that's true, that could mean reducing the risk of heart disease, Britain's biggest killer. So I think that warrants a trust me experiment. Should we be eating lots of these foods in particular? How well do they actually work? I've come to Cardiff Arms Park Rugby Club, armed with my three supposed superfoods. My targets, though, aren't the rugby players, but these chaps. The Cardiff Arms Park Male Choir. They regularly sing their hearts out at rugby matches. I've brought your your diets for the next next few weeks. If you want to have a look, these look like beetroot. They they are beetroot. Beets. We'll be asking each of the members with higher than normal blood pressure to eat watermelon, beetroot, and garlic over three weeks to see whether any of these foods really can do what the headlines claim. How many people have high blood pressure? It's almost everyone. About a third of adults in the UK suffer from high blood pressure. It's measured in millimetres of mercury. The ideal for a healthy adult is about 120, so we're selecting members of the choir who have a reading above 130 to take part in the experiment. Meanwhile, blood pressure expert Dr Andy Webb joins me in the kitchen to sample our superfoods. Yeah, it's delicious, isn't it? We've got three different dishes, garlic dish, watermelon dish and some beetroot dishes. In theory, all three of our superfoods essentially work in the same way. They lower blood pressure by making our blood vessels dilate, allowing our blood to flow more freely. But exactly how they're supposed to do this is different in each case. For garlic, the active ingredient is thought to be a chemical called allicin, 